What's going on everybody? This is Brian from sneakerfiles.com and today we're going to show you a closer and on feet look at the Air Jordan 5 OG known as Black Metallic. Now if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button below and if you like this video give it a thumbs up. Now these are going to drop Saturday, July 23rd, 2016. Retail price is $220 and you can cop these at Chic Shoes Retailers. There will be a link in the description below. Okay, so a lot of you guys are asking why I know 2-3 on the back. Well, Jordan Brand wanted to make this I pretty much identical to the originals. Of course, there's going to be some differences. I don't have the OGs, um, but I'm planning on doing a 2000 or 1999, whatever year they um, retroed in, a comparison on that. So there's no 2-3, and the 2-3 was actually a Michael Jordan PE, and he's not released to the public. So, as you can see, pretty much true to form. You have all black uppers, which is done in new buck. Overall material and stitching is done very very nice in my opinion. There is minimal glue stains But it's almost like a standard nowadays, which is you know kind of sad, but it is what it is Anyways, we have Nike branding throughout on the hill, which is probably the most You know looked forward to then You got the Air Jordan tab flipped upside down The tongue is a bit longer though than I remember from the, the older retro release all black on the liner and then I pulled out the insole really quick for you guys and that is all red with white Nike Air so they went pretty pretty overboard not overboard I wouldn't say but uh, really well as far as um, the Nike Air branding because you also have it on the toggle in the lace lock you might be able to see that Nike right there translucent transparent and then the Nike on the toggle itself and you have your 3M tongue Jumpman stitched in red then we have a transparent netting as well as on the panels show you that real quick so your metallic silver hits as you can see are on the midsole which is inspired by the Fighter jet flames. Check out that speckled detailing. It's like the air unit <clears throat> looks yellowed, which is kind of cool to me. I guess it's kind of brings out some like OG-ness to them. So to the sole, we have your blue translucent hits, Jumpman, and the Nike Air. So pretty close to the OG as far as the branding goes. Um, I can't really speak on the shape because I don't have the the OG um, black metallics But um, I should have a video for the older retro release uh, in the next day or so Maybe by Friday, hopefully um, so uh, Yeah, I know <clears throat> today I actually uploading two videos I don't want to flood it, but there's a lot of releases coming. And I'm trying to cover them all so Please bear with me on that. But I'm sure you guys have been waiting to see this video. I know a lot of you have been asking about it. And <clears throat> overall, I think it's a... They did pretty good. Like, I don't really have any complaints about, like, the glue stains, the construction of it, and overall like that. But again, this is... I might have got lucky. So, like I always say, check your pairs if you're buying in person. Because it could. it is possible that you could just have, like, a, a totally butchered pair. But... Now, let's get to the on feet. Everybody, so that was your closer and on feet look at the Air Jordan 5 OG Black Metallic. And just to recap, they dropped this Saturday, July 23rd, 2016. Retail price will be $220. And you can get these at Chic Shoes Retailers. There'll be a link in the description below. Now, um, 
Man, in my opinion, this is probably one of the hottest releases of the summer, um, aside from maybe the OVO 12s, but those are gonna be really, to my understanding, those are gonna be pretty limited. So this is more of a general release, but the hype on them is really <clears throat> out there. But in my opinion, if you really, really want the shoes, you'll be able to get them. Just put in your raffle tickets, and if you're buying online, make sure to wake up early enough. It's kind of like the fours, because, um, you know, I didn't see a lot of people miss out on the fours. I'm sure there are some, but to me, like, I woke up a little bit late, and I just entered, I believe, the draw, and I was selected. or It was a draw, or I just tried to check out. It was one of the two, but I got them fairly easy on the sneakers app, which I strike out with pretty much all the time. So, um... Comparing this, I, I think it's more going to be more of a release, a release like the fours, the white cement with the Nike Air, in the sense of um, there's going to be enough pairs available, um, and if you try hard enough, you'll be able to get your pair. Uh, just the only other thing is, I think too, if you miss out and you can wait a little bit, I'm pretty pretty sure there's going to be various uh, restocks happening. I know the fours that happened, so. I'm pretty sure this is gonna happen as well, and uh, but yeah, the hype is pretty, <laughs> pretty strong on this one. I'm not gonna lie, but overall, like it's cool shoe. The tongue does look very, very high to me. Um, something I'm not a huge fan of, but um, it is what it is. Uh, to be honest, like you know, I don't think that the OGs had that the the height of the tongue. Um, but we're gonna see about the 2000 or 99 whatever year it was the retro release of that of this model We're gonna see the differences with that by Friday So leave a comment below and once again, I apologize for uploading twice in a day I don't like to you know <clears throat> do a bunch I usually like to do once a day But there's gonna be a few times this week where there's gonna be twice a day But I know you guys have been waiting for this and I just got them so and I was pretty excited to put them on feet and show you guys So thanks for watching leave a comment below let us know if you're going after them or not. And if you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe.